Fellas, let me, let me kick things off. Let me kick things off and then we'll get straight into it because I can see you two uh, are busy already. Misfits Boxing is coming to London January the 14th. KSI versus Dylan Dennis topped by a fire undercard underneath it. We've seen some of the guys go face-to-face -face already, some digitally, some in person today. We've got an exciting one. Idris Virgo and Anthony Taylor join us on the line today. This one is going off. Fellas... How are we doing? I'm good. How's, how's the fat chubby kid doing over there, man? You good? Uh, Sing it. I'm about 200 pounds. I'm about, I'm about like, I'm on weight. I'm like uh, 79.5. I'm in Colombia right now. Ooh, these women out here are beautiful. I'm chilling. I'm in a jacuzzi. You already know what it is. You should have been chilling, man. You should have uh, been chilling, man. You know what it is. You should get yourself in the gym, man. You don't know what you sound to sign up to, man. You sound to get destroyed. Like, hey, come on, man. Hey, don't take your hey, life, you bro. You easy work. You easy work. <laughs> oh, easy work. Look, you easy work. You oh, easy work. Work. I'm about to, hey, I'm about to, I'm about to, I'm about to run, hey, I'm about to run through you like a pack of condoms. That's, that's how I'm going to run through you sure. like a pack of condoms. Absolutely. Uh, come on, baby. Sure. I'm here. You, you signed a contract. You just signed your life away. Thank Listen, you, sir. You went, you went, you're just about to survive against Tommy Fury. You're just about to survive against Jack Lynch. You're not going to survive against me. I'm the true, true Love Island King out here. I'll knock you out. This, yeah. is, this ain't no game here. Oh. I'll take you out. Guaranteed. You're, hey, hey, what, what happened to all that talk when you said about Jack Lynch was going to beat me up? You yeah. said, oh, I guarantee Jack Lynch was going to beat me up. You said he was going to knock me out. Look what I did. You better uh, survive uh, against Jack. You better survive against Jack. What you mean? What you mean? You finish? You no, you are on cloud nine. Listen, you are on cloud nine. I don't think you know what you're saying, and I don't think you know how you're acting. You're on cloud nine. Literally, yo, Matt, you're crazy, man. You're crazy, hey, though. Hey, Idris, Idris, you need to go rewatch that fight with me and Jack Fincham. You know I destroyed Jack Fincham. Easy money oh, right here. On, you're, easy oh. work, bro. You can't. Come on, bro. You don't have no knockout power. I'm you gonna knock out power. So wait, 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 wait. You, you, so you're going to meet me in the middle of the ring and we're going to go toe-to-toe -to -toe and you're going to say I've got no knockout power. Are you willing to do that? Bro, if Wait, you're going to do that, right? are, you, are you going to do that? Me and you, middle of the yeah. ring, we go toe-to-toe? -to -toe. Yeah. Absolutely. Okay, let's That's give the fans what they want. Let's give the fans what they want. Let's Don't back up. Don't, Guys, don't back you, up. I'm a you've, you've made my job very easy. For the first few minutes of this, I've got to say, I just wanted to sit back and watch. We have here a 12 and 0 pro professional box. We have in the other side Anthony Taylor, who has been on fire lately. And you've both just you've 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 both just accepted the terms to meet in the middle of the ring and get straight off and trade. Do either of you believe this fight even goes past one round if that happens? If that scenario happens, the bell goes and you both step forward and need to take a back step. Listen, Chris. It's Chris, he, he doesn't pose no threat to me. I, why the hell do you think I'm in Colombia chilling, having fun? He's not a threat to me. I'll stand in the middle ring with anybody. I'm the hottest guy. I'm the hottest guy in, in boxing since Floyd Mayweather. Look at me. This is my eighth. This, I'm, the, I'm, the hottest, I'm the hottest guy since Floyd Mayweather. Yeah. This is my eighth pay-per-view, baby, in one year. Come on. Wait, one wait, year. Wait. My eighth pay-per-view. Make your mind up. One, you Floyd Mayweather. Two, you Mike Tyson. Make your, might make your mind up who you want to be. But let's be honest, just, if me and you meet in the middle of the ring, there's no bad doubt. I am knocking you out. Ain't going past one round. You're not going to resist my power. You're going to handle it. I'm too powerful for you. It, Idris. Look. Idris, let, let, let me ask you, Idris, what kind of test is Anthony Taylor to you? you, you you've seen what he's been doing in the ring lately. What, what kind of test do you see Anthony Taylor as? I don't, I don't think Andrew Taylor is a test. I, I think this, I think Andrew Taylor is easy work for myself, you know what I mean? Like, I've got to give him a bit of a props because he accepted the fight on me. Out of all, all the guys I've been calling out, he had, he had the most, I'd say, the balls to accept the fight. But Sidney Winnerly, he should overthink what he's just going to side himself into because literally, he does not know what's freaking awakening him in that ring. Like, I can't wait because I, I actually thought he was a coward, but Sometimes Cowards got to come out of there in bright light, and he has. But, mate, I don't know, man. He, he's literally an idiot. Especially to be in Colombia in a freaking hot tub chilling. He said there's loads of girls. Oh, shit. 
He said there's loads of birds around. I don't even see one bird. We have him in the hot tub. So the guy just, the guy just says lies. He's a liar. Where are the birds? Where are the birds? Ah, oh, exactly. No words. Lies. Lies. Anthony, maybe maybe we'll question you on on the girls later. I'll let Idris and yourself pick that up maybe on social. Let me let me stick it to boxing right now. At twelve and zero, how high on your resume does Idris Virgo sit? If you get the win against Idris on January the fourteenth, how high does he sit? You won't have to. I mean, it, it, I mean, don't do shit to me. I mean, I'm just being a uh, Love Island guy, another Love Island guy. I mean. Look, I respect Idris Virgo as a fighter because he's stepping in that ring with with me. And I tell that Chris, you heard me say that many times. Well, Ashley yeah. Petty, Jack Fincham. Yeah. I've always said, hey, I respect anybody who goes into the ring with me because we're both putting our lines on the line. But I don't give a fuck if Idris Virgo wants to stand there and bang. I don't give a fuck. We can do that. Every fighter that KSI, Mans, and Dick Paul, and anybody told me to fight, I never said no. I said, let's do it. Right when, when Mams called me up and said, you want to fight Idris Virgo? I said, let's do it. Send a fucking contract. How am I a coward? I accepted a fight automatically. Oh. I, was, I was offered, I, was, I, I asked to fight Tyron Woodley. He said no. I offered to fight Joe Forner. He said no. I offered to fight fucking Salt Poppy. He said no. King Kenny said no. Only person who was willing to fight me was Idris Virgo. I give you your respect for that. I appreciate you fighting me. I'm not worrying about you. You're not a threat to me, bro. You're not going to be able to handle my people style. You have no power. We see it. You can laugh, but look, it's, you can laugh, Idris, but it says in your record. You have 12 wins with two TK with two TKOs. You yeah. don't have the knockout power. Of course. And, and I'm going to be real. You're a good boxer. Yeah, you're, you're a good boxer. Yeah, for, for a person being 12 and 0, that's not, it's not bad. I can't say you're a bum. But huh. you're not going to beat me because I'm the pretty boy. What I do, everything I touch is gold. I'm like fucking Rumpelstiltskin. I touch everything, turn to fucking gold. The ring embraces me. London embraces me. And I'm, I'm sure? going to get way more fat. Yes. I'm, bro, you look like a generic version of Apollo Creed. You're going down in the first round. <laughs> I guarantee you. Uh, I do would say you got some good white liners. But as you said, on 12 and 0, two knockouts, so... You might think I've got no knockout power. Let's meet in the middle of the ring. That's it. Simple as that. Idris. You stay in the power. Look, 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 look. You ain't got to keep saying it more than five times. Just say it one time. Hey, Anthony. No, because you're not listening. Because you're not listening. Idris. I just heard you. And I just, I just heard you and I just responded to your answer. I said, I will meet you in the middle of the ring. You keep bringing the same thing up. You sound like a hypocrite. All I'm, I'm saying is, you're the one sounding like a hypocrite. You, 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 you're, you're sharing the ring with one of the most top, with one of the most electrifying man in boxing right now. You know, I'm one of the top dogs out there who's making noise out there on social media. Now, I'm not, not saying I'm like KSI, Logan not Paul. I'm not, I'm not saying I'm like KSI, Logan Paul, and Jake Paul, but I am that guy that people do respect now because I come from the streets. I come to get it, and I'll fight whoever the fuck they want me to fight, and no, I don't complain. I just do. Idris, no, Idris, let me ask you. Let, let, let me ask you. How do you feel when Anthony refers to you as a Love Islander? Because you were a boxer before Love Island. You were a boxer yeah. after Love Island. So how do you feel when he says you're just another Love Islander? No, no, so way about it. Because Love Island gave me the step of stone for me to be on this platform. Love Island got me my fan base. Love Island made me who I am. In the sense, I'll be able to pro box up before Love Island, but also I've got to give a big shout out to um, Love Island because I am yeah. where I am because of Love Island. And um, yeah, he's fought two Love Islands before. Um, he's lost, he lost against one of them. He drew against the second one. So he's now this is the third time he's going to fight a Love Island. And I am guarantee you, the original Love Island boxer is going to knock him out. So it's just going to be an entertaining fight. And he should stop taking it easy with being in a jacuzzi and saying he's, oh, no, man. He, to me, he sounds like he chats loads of shit, loads of rubbish. And um, I just can't wait to destroy his hype train because I think this is a big hype train with him. He just likes, he likes to speak up. He thinks he's like the flow whatever. He thinks he's, he's like uh, Mike Tyson with the pick with style. He seems he's going to buy me ear off in a bit. 
it's, it's all talk. It's all talk. It's all talk. I've been around people like this before. As I said before, I've 12 fights. I've been around every single kind of style. I've got my spirits. And to me, this is going to be an easy fight for me. And I'm, I just can't wait to get out of there and um, punch his head in. It's going to be very fun. I don't give a fuck if you train with KSI. I don't give a fuck if you train with fucking Tyson Fury, whoever. My whole team... My whole fucking fight team will blow your fucking fight team out the fucking water. From MMA, no to chance. No Bro, chance. who you got? Who you got? No who you chance. got? Who you got? Ain't none of y'all beating me in MMA. None of y'all beating me in MMA. My whole squad. You know what? You know what? You know what? If you're all this talk, after not being a boxing, I'll do a fucking MMA fight with you after. You know, you, knock yeah, ass you, out. you put that in the contract. I swear to God, I'll oh, fight you again for MMA. Today? All right, all right. <laughs> Hey, look, 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 if you if you really if you really about it, look, put that in the contract. You'll find me in the MMA and Bellator, and I'll whoop your ass on that ground and pound. It doesn't matter. You can't fuck with my power, bro. Nobody can <laughs> fuck with my power. You Man. laugh, but who have you honestly beat? You have to be no name. Your flow rate coming to my weight category. Think about it, bro. Right, in the Think last five it. fights, I fought at first away. Oh my god. Huh? Who fought? Who have you fought? Man, push. Who have you fought? You, you, look at my record. Look at my record. Look, look, look. It's a bad one. Not you, bro. Hey, 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 hey. Put like this. Let's do this. Put up, put up five grand that you gonna knock me out in the first round. I'll put five grand. Let's go. Okay, you go. No, you gonna put up five grand that you gonna knock me out. I ain't putting put shit fuck, up. Man. I want, I want, I want to see you put up your old money, saying you're gonna knock me out in the first round. Because if you don't, I'm taking that five grand and it's coming with me. Fellas, I'm, I'm, gonna, gonna, go. I'm gonna step in. I'm gonna step in before any a, a, any bookmaking watchers get us in trouble. Uh, and let right. me talk about, let me talk about your style uh, for a moment because you came you came onto the scene. And very quickly, uh, again, I, I hark back to the the original digital face off that we did with with Ashley. Uh, a few months ago now, and you brought up that you were going to do the peekaboo style. Ash said in that in, in that very same video, what Ash was saying he was going to do the drunken master. You were going to miss. You were going to come forward and throw in it, and you put him down in the first round. That drunken style. It's fair to say you had the number of that all over. Idris has the the body breaker nickname because of his fighting style. How does the peekaboo style face up or square up to the body break? Man, pe pe look, I'm about to run through his fucking fighting style, and after I run through his fighting style, I'm gonna run through Floyd's half belly shell style. I'm gonna beat up Idris Virgo better than I beat up fucking Jack Fincham and Ashley Teddy. You saw the confidence that Ashley Teddy had in the very beginning of my face off. Then look what happened during the fight. Take it easy, Taylor. Take it easy. Now I'm coming to get this work. Idris, you want to meet me in the middle? I gladly meet you in the middle. Your little yes, body shots ain't going to do shit to me because, look, you I'm sure? a little shorter than you. Are yeah, you bro. Sure? Oh, you yeah. sure? Listen, yeah. you, got, you, you, got the Mike, you got the Mike Tyson because you start a wish list. I don't know where you got from thinking you got that down to a T. You've not done Pinky Bruce Star. I've not seen it once. I don't think you've got Pinky Bruce Star. You think you, have, well, you haven't got it? So, so then why I'm the favor here, then? Obviously, I'm the favorite. I'm the favorite in this fight. In this fight, you're not the favorite. I'm the, the favorite, dude. dude the just favorite. because you got look, cancel is ducking me, so he threw you. Cancel, they do you cancel and knock you out as well. Oh, oh, oh man, cancel will finish you. So, so, cancel will finish me. Cancel will even finish Jake Paul. Come on, bro. Jake, listen, cancel will be a Jake Paul as well. You know, yeah. you know, 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 you Listen, listen. No one has been able to knock me out or knock me down in a fight. What we'll makes you jump to forty? Jump to listen, forty. We'll see you, 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 you realize our fight is the real main event. Wait, what, what, what happened to your MMA fights? What happened to your MMA career? What happened there? 
Talk to us oh, about that. I still, I, I, huh? I, 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 I can't really talk about it, but uh, uh, talk about the belt. You gotta let me finish. You gotta let me finish. I'm fighting in Bellator in March. Going back to MMA in March, so yeah, I can still do both. I'm a, I'm a monster. I've been offered. Look, I've been offered to go on Love Island too. Bef- um, before you know, we, so you let both of me. Before we hear about any Misfits MMA debuts. And I want to, I want to, you know, I, I don't want to cut too many people off. I want to, but there's one point that you brought up again there that I just, I want us to box this off. I want to get this on camera from both sides because it makes for fireworks on January the 14th. Both of you have said the round one, the bell goes. Do you have each other's word? Anthony, do you give your word? Idris, do you give your word that when the referee says touch gloves just before that first round, that both of you will stay there? When you touch yeah. gloves, rather than walk back to your corners with your coach who says any last words and pats you on the back and everything else, both of you will stay there. And I'll stay there. there. And then when the bell goes, you're at one another from from the first second. We want to see this action, man. We want to see this smoke. Hey, hey, no, let's no, 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 no. Let's, let's, let's be real. <laughs> we, I, we, we would do that, but physically the ref will not allow us to stay there. They will tell you to go to your corner. Are you ready? Are you ready? It's never happened in boxing before. They're not going to lose this already. So I'm down, Jesus. like I said. We, we can touch gloves. You saw the way that I fight, Idris. You know, I've never backpedaled. I've never backpedaled nobody in a fight. I came forward Tommy on Tommy Ferry. Ferry. I, I, we talk about I came forward on Tommy Ferry. Look, bro, I'm not. You, you're, you're looking at the same fighter as I fought Tommy Ferry. I'm not the same fighter. You've been fighting a lot longer than I have in boxing. I've been boxing for about, about, about uh, one year. And this is my eighth paper fucking view. Like, bro, I'm doing Floyd Mayweather shit, bro. Like, 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 I'm fucking Chris Tucker out here, bro. Like, like, I'm doing Chris Tucker shit. You, you know how many girls out there loving me in England, bro? Like, man, my fucking fans love me. Like, you call up Love Island and you tell them to put me on their fucking show. How about you call to say, hey, I got this character who want to go on Love Island. Cause after I whoop your ass, I'm going on Love Island, and I'll be like, "Yeah, I'm Anthony Taylor. I'm the guy who beat up Idris Virgo. I'm the guy who oh, beat up Jack Benson, and I'm the guy who's gonna beat up Tommy Fury." You've already fought Tommy Fury. So what are you on about? Yeah. On, on a two what? weeks' notice. On a two weeks' notice. Two weeks' notice. Don't worry, you got longer than two weeks for this fight. So listen, meet me in the middle of the Idris, 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 what what attributes do you have besides besides looking like? Apollo Creed. Apollo Creed is a legend, you know, just for a fact. Hey, you but Apollo Creed is a legend. I, yeah, but but I'm but I'm the real Adonis Creed. I'm more of the legendary killer. I'm that guy. <laughs> I'm that guy. I'm that guy. You, you, know you don't have power. You don't have power. The only thing I can give you is height. Kudos. I give you height, but as far as power, I I've got, got more power. I've got I've got I've got power. I've got speed. I've got height. I've got good looks. Better than your looks. I got the confidence. What else do you want? I'm the full package. I'm the full package. Hey, hey I'm gonna tell you what Mike Tyson told everybody else. Everybody has a plan until they get punched in the face. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, about to, yeah. I'm about to punch you in the show. face. So I'm about to break your face, and I'm about. I'm. Can't say he's gonna kick me off the car after I beat you up. He ain't gonna want me to fight. You're not gonna be fighting again. You're not gonna be fighting again. You're not gonna be fighting hey. again. I, hey, I'm going to beat you up in the cage. I'm going to beat you up in the ring. I'm going to beat you up in the street. I'm going to beat you up in the slot boxing contest. I'll be up in the hotel. See the hotel. Hey, 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 in a hotel, bro, I will drop you on your head and I will oh, turn you into up. a pretzel. Oh. I will turn you into a pretzel and sprinkle salt on you. You be salty all night, bro. If this was prison, bro. Boy, if this was crazy, you'd be my bitch. No. You won't be my the bitch. If this is got, prison. Hey, this got, you, 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 right, you'll, right, be right, on right. The, you'll be on the top bunk. If this, if you was my cellmate, you'll be top bunk. Huh? <laughs> if this was yeah. prison, you'd be top. Listen, you, you can't hang with me. My people you can't, can't be touched. You can't do me. Pe- what the fuck? Don't do you me. What style? Oh, don't. Oh. What, what style do you have? You just look at me. I'm the prince. I'm fucking. I have an eight cards. You look out of shape. shape. What are you on the belt? What are you on the belt? Are you going to be making it? Wait. It's so, wait. it's so sad that KSI sends his lap dog to, to take out an assassin. It's so, it's so sad. Of course, he's puppy. Why is he saying you? Why is he saying you? 
What did Jake Paul say? Yeah. Yeah. Listen, listen. I'm that guy, buddy. I'm that sex symbol. I'm that Miss Casanova. <laughs> yeah, nah. I'm Miss oh, Casanova. That's a yeah, come on. Look, 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 look. I'm going there. Oh, bro, I can beat you up on a Monday, Tuesday. I'm going to beat you up on Wednesday and Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Look, look, I'm going to walk with you, bro. Bro, bro. Oh, don't, bro. Don't, bro. bro. You want hey, we, 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 Columbia, you know what they do in Columbia. Stop playing with me. We going to party and bullshit. Hey, we <laughs> party <laughs> and bullshit. Where are you going, man? <laughs> I've got to say, this guy, this guy, this guy, he's playing with us now. But this guy, we've got to say, he's brought some big attention to the scene. These, these last not few... anymore. But are you, not are anymore. you the man to, are you the man to halt this address? Are you the man? Because I, I get what you're saying. Listen, and Anthony, come on, man. You know you're playing with us a little bit, but it's it's part of the show, isn't it? But Idris is saying he's going to stop you. Idris, are you the man to stop the Anthony Taylor train? Guaranteed, I'm going to stop Anthony Taylor on January the 14th. This is the end of his rare. He's not going to come back from this loss. I'm telling you now. He's got, after this, he's going to stop respecting opponents. Because right about now, he's not giving them the respect. I do not like that. Anthony, are you a disrespectful fighter? I'm going to give him my Chris Rock impression. How the hell I don't respect Idris Burger? Like, give me one second right now. Like, I know. He a boxer, okay, I get it, I get it, he a boxer, but I'm gonna beat his ass just like anybody any day. Look, I don't give a fuck if he's a boxer, a boy type boxer, or whatever. Look, I said I respect him for going in that ring with them, ring with me. I respect everybody who steps in the cage with me, who steps in the ring with me, because they have to understand, I'm going to literally kill you. I'm going to try to kill you. I'm physically <laughs> going to try to put bodily harm on you, Idris. Yeah, I'm gonna pray for your safety. That's what I do. Oh. Look, man, I like I like I like to joke around. We know that I'm a jokester. I like to have fun. But when that bell rings, bro, it's a whole other side. I'm coming to kick your ass, and there ain't nothing you can do. You ain't never been through the grind that I've been through. You, 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 you don't through, know. I've been through. I've been through. Go on, tell you, me you've been through. Go on, tell me you been through. You wanna know through? Go on, what you been through. I had to shake my ass to make money for sure, You know what I'm saying? That shit. You don't yeah. understand what it feels to be a stripper like me. Yeah, you don't understand? Man. You know how many girls were pulling? You know how many girls kept pulling on me? Bro, yeah. I felt abused and used by all these women when I was stripping. You don't know about that. That is some good shit, man. There is, a saying, there is a saying in this world that we should always leave them wanting more. And guys, oh, I speak as a fight fan, I cannot wait to see this fight week. I cannot wait. Dylan Dennis versus KSI is a hell of a main event. This card is... Well, wait, well, I cannot KSI wait. KSI is fighting my sloppy seconds. KSI is fighting my sloppy seconds. Oh, oh, shit. Shit. I cannot <laughs> wait to see Idris Virgo and Anthony Taylor on that top table going off at one another. I know one thing's for certain, we're going to have to have Andy and the rest of the security team there because there's no way I think that this goes past without one of you stepping a little too close to the other one. Neither of you wants to take a step back. Guys, look, look, look. Some hey, 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 I don't know how these England dudes, y'all be carrying knives and shit, so I might have to step in. You might try to stab me to get the upper hand. Listen, fucking around. You man. can't fight. You huh? can't fight. I'm going to bring, hey, you know what? Oh. I'm going to bring you a vibrator because you out here talking about that. Let me do Anthony Taylor style. Stop playing with me, man. Stop playing with me, man. Stop playing with me, man. Because, because ah. you realize, do you realize how big, how big a, how famous I am in, in the yeah, UK. Man. I'm that man. guy. Yeah, man. I like how Icarus, I like this guy. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I could come, hey, I could come out there next hey. week and spar at your gym. Uh -oh. uh, hey, that's how I, that, I could come out there next week and spar. I'll bring my, oh, I'll bring week, my, man. I'll bring me, AJ McKee, and Rampage Jackson. We come out there and spar. Let's oh, get it. Yo, do it, man. Stop paying with me, man. Do that shit, man. Hey. Look, look, hey. Chris, so, you know, man. Chris, you know I won this press conference. Nobody can rock the mic like me. Oh, no one can look like me. Oh, no one. Hey, 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 hey. hey. I, 
I'm hey, that guy. I'm that guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look, you see, you're nervous. You signed yeah, that contract. You're talking talk, all that man. talk. Yeah, yeah, I want to. I want to see more. I want to see more, and I cannot wait, guys. I'm going to leave it there because I could watch you two go back and forth all night. I wouldn't know when to call it, so I'm going to call it now. But listen, January the 14th, we find out. We find out who is the baddest of the bad. We find out whose train stops who. Idris Virgo, the body breaker, the pretty boy, Anthony Taylor. They go head to head, January the 14th, and we can't wait. We'll see you fight week, boys. Let's go. Let's go. Good luck. <laughs> You're going to need it. <laughs>